welcome to the party demonstration of fan cache recognition uh, with the uh, voice outputs along with emergency messaging by using gsm and gps and also continuously message monitoring on this lcd screen so in this project main components are like we are using four flex sensors in order to detect the finger folding levels and mem sensor to get the hand position and to send the message alerts we are using the gsm module and uh, that message consists of location also that location will be retrieved from this gps module and the voices will be announced from this uh, api 33a3 voice module that is uh, audio playback recorder through this speaker so here is in the small speaker for voice announcement and all these input and output modules are interfaced to the arduino nano board and also the same message will be displayed on this 16 by 2 lcd screen and we have interfaced that to the nano board through this i square c or uh, lcd motor uh, lcd driver so here in this one this three flex sensors are used to announce the eight combination based eight voices and the fourth flex sensor is for emergency uh, message sending purpose so when the person fold this finger then automatically the system will send the message alerts to the registered phone number and that message consists of uh, location map link along with alerts i need help so when we demonstrate this project under the roof without any sky vision to this gps antenna so we will get like this 00, zero values so if you want to get the live location values then we need to place this kit under the sky view then uh, we will get the satellite vision for this gps antenna and it will provide as a live location uh, along with uh, light and values so when we place this under the sky view uh, due to uh, like uh, with the help of trilateration method the gps antenna will get the signal and this light so the voice white color light will blinks when it got the satellite vision and the next uh, let me explain the connection wise we have interfaced the flex sensors respectively a0 a1 a2 a3 pins a4 and a5 for the uh, mem sensor adxl 345 and lcd module so both are uh, based on the i square c protocol that's why we can uh, connect directly to the a4 and a5 parallelly and gsm module at uh, transmitting pin of our nano board and eighth pin is connected to the gps module and uh, api 333 module uh, connected the 2 3 4 5 6 7 10 11 pins uh, directly to this eight voices combination so here uh, let us see the demonstration and uh, the whole system getting power supply from the battery right so now this is the battery we have attached for this one uh, the battery ratings are 2600 milliamps 3.7 volts which is rechargeable battery and the main power supply on off switch is this is the main on off switch so when we on this if it blinks right it's coming like this if it is continuously blinks without uh, getting welcome message so then just connect the charger pin at the b type connector and uh, then there is a light indication on this one so the red light blinks means the battery is charging once the blinking completes it is continuously on there is indication of battery is fully charged so the first step before demonstration the, uh, this project is keep the kit under the sky view to get the satellite vision and the next step is second step is keep the battery under fully charged and the next insert a valid sim card into this gsm module so better to use a micro sim card otherwise nano sim card with micro sim card adapter okay in this one the man now should be like this and push to lock push to unlock okay after everything was done now mount this on your hand gently so only try to use this below cloth to mount it on your hand Unsuccessful mounts. You can on and off the switch and keep the hand on resting mode. Right, it's a resting mode. And now on the power supply. After it's getting on, you can disconnect the charging cable from this one. Right, welcome message will be displayed. So wait for 10 to 15 seconds as we need to provide the time for the gsm modem to get the signal so for the confirmation you can make a call to the sim card on this one you can get the ringtone to the sim card otherwise you will get the switch on and off right and now 
So when I uh, bending this one any direction, so same as will be displayed over here. You can see that. Okay, this is the first measure. It's considering zero zero zero. So zero zero one and zero one zero. And zero double one. I did my And one double zero. I did coffee. Okay. And main thing is while demonstrating the little finger should not be folded. I did my sheet. Right, total eight combinations successfully done, and the next thing is uh, message sending alert poppers. If I'm folding this finger on LCD display, we can see the message sending. Right, we got the message alerts. Right. And the main thing, I forgot to tell you about the setup. So when you on the gauge, unfold the fingers properly like this, and you can reset. So that is a reference signal captured from this flex sensors by the nano board. After initialization successful done, when you see the zero zero values, now from now onwards, if you bend something fingers, then uh, that reference voltage will be increases. So if you fold fingers like this. And if you reset the system, then this is going to be the initial value for me. Right.